Wait, opponent, come back. I haven't done anything yet. You don't know what I'm doing. You don't know. I haven't even blown up your land yet. Stop it. Am I getting sandbagged? They're like, oh, they're going to be big mad when I blow that up. And I am going to be big mad when you blow that up. Hello, my fair citizens. My name is Strider Stone. I'm the mayor of Sodium City, and welcome to the very first Explorer format video. Now, let me know in the comment section below if you want to see more of this format, but also let me know how you enjoy it. I have some opinions, but I'll let you know in a later video. So let's jump into the deck tech and I'll show you what we got. This is a Jun land destruction list that I really, really enjoyed. I'm a big fan of Jund in general, and with the addition of Zeotora's Proving Ground, it made the mana base so much better and so much smoother. So much, it's so buttery smooth. <laughs> Love it. The main new card that we're gonna be brewing around here is Arcane Bombardment. Now this card is super sweet. I'm a huge fan. It is the definition of a snowball card. Now if they can't deal with this right away, it's amazing. If they can deal with it, it's really, really sad. <laughs> but once you cast one spell, cast another one, cast another one, it's just like boop, 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 boop. It, it's absolutely ridiculous. I didn't think of doing Mastermind's Acquisition. Now that I think about that, all right, it's the very first day of the new set, okay? Give me a break, all right? Give me a break. Give it a give it a week, all right? I'll probably be messing around with this card for like a week because I think it has so much untapped potential and I think I'm going to break it. Just give it a little bit, okay? There are a couple tricks that you can actually do with this card to really optimize it and start targeting spells. Take it away, Past Strider. Now, with Arcane Bombardment, you can almost target spells by having as little of them in the graveyard as possible. Because this card is really just designed for you to only cast one instant or sorcery per turn, and this really includes from the beginning of the game. Um, and that's zero instant sorceries until you cast an Arcane Bombardment, and then it's one per turn. One on yours, one on theirs, one on yours, one on theirs. And I'll kind of explain why. So currently, we have our Kimba Barbit, and the only instant sorcerer we have in the graveyard is Cultivate. So that means, regardless of what I cast, we're going to be able to cast Cultivate. So, for this instance, let's cast Star. Obviously, our only spell is going to be Cultivate. Boom. Free cast. Boom, boom. An easy Star of Extinction. So now that we already have Cultivate, because we cast Star of Extinction, now we only have Star of Extinction, so anything that we cast will now only get Star of Extinction. So we know that it's gonna blow everything up. We don't necessarily have to cast Star of Extinction. One of the things you will have to look out for, however, is going to be when we get Baleful Mastery or something in the graveyard. Because obviously, it's not something we can really cast unless they have a creature or Planeswalker on the battlefield, and Invoke Despair is something that we need to have in the graveyard so that we can cast it for free every single turn, including theirs if we have instances. So obviously, Invoke Despair, unfortunately, it's going to get our Baleful Mastery out. But at this point, you're literally thinning out their deck, preventing them from getting any type of lands whatsoever. They're going to get to the point where they're going to fish every single forest out of their deck and they're not going to have any more because we're just going to blow so many up every single turn. The next issue obviously becomes once you start casting Invoke Despair every single turn, you kind of just get way too many cards in your hand. So you have to discard the hand size. Now, there is an argument. It's a bad argument. But there is an argument to play something like Reliquary Tower. I actually have no idea if that's in this format. It has to be. There's an argument to be made to do it so that you never have to discard spells because right now we have to discard at least one instant sorcery, which means we can't guarantee targeting our invoke, which is despair, <laughs> infinite despair. <laughs> Thanks, Past Strider. You're the best. But what we really care about here, the meme potatoes is going to be land destruction. Now we're gonna be using Star of Extinction, Casualties of War, Bedeck Bedazzle, However, Bedazzle is the star of this deck. 
You wouldn't think so because a lot of people think it's a bad card. However, I think it's actually amazing, amazing removal. It's two mana early removal. It deals with a lot of indestructible nonsense. It's it's pretty good card. I'd say it's a pretty good card. However, the destroying any land or any non-basic land and then doing two damage to the opponent's face, beautiful, beautiful. Once all their lands are gone, you just target your own Cascading Cataracts, hit their face, roll the footage, I'll, I'll show you. So Cascading Cataracts is actually one of the most important cards in the deck. It's really important early game and late game. So early game, we wanna make sure we have that in a red source for our Cleansing Wildfire. Cleansing Wildfire destroys a land, but obviously since Cascading Cataracts is indestructible, it doesn't actually destroy it. So it says, it's controller may search our library for a basic land card, put it in the battlefield, tap, then draw a card. So we're going to quote unquote, blow up our Cascading Cataracts, search our library for a basic land, put it in play tapped, and then we get to draw a card. So it's kind of like Explore, but think of a better Explore, because Explore is already great, you get to draw a card, and then put an extra land if you have it. But this, you get to search your library for a land, put it into play, and then draw a card. So you're thinning out the deck and then drawing a card, which is ridiculous, right? So it's a fantastic thing. However, if you get it early game, let's say you have three land out, and two of them are a color and the cascading cataracts is open if you target it and do an auto pay it will not tap this for whatever reason so otter ta <laughs> otter so auto tapper will absolutely fuck you on this so you want to make sure you hard tap that as much as possible and then you can just do the auto pay for the red source to keep your other land open anytime you target your cataracts with that it will just I don't know i don't know why it bugs the shit out of me it doesn't make any sense that's just how it is so the other reason cascading cataracts is very important is because it's part of our win condition so we kind of have two win conditions we have invoke despair which is great but we also have bedeck bedazzle so bedeck obviously amazing because it's removal it's really good for early game because it's two mana great but Dazzle is destroy target non-basic land, deals two damage to target opponent or planeswalker. So it's very important because it says opponent. However, since we are going to have, you know, Star of Extinction, Cleansing Wildfire, maybe more Bedeck Bedazzles, opponent's not going to have any lands left, right? It's just going to be so annoying for them, it doesn't matter. So what we end up having to do is the following. Unlike their upkeep or whenever, because this is an instant, we're going to Bedazzle target our own land the one that's indestructible and then target their face so it's a six mana shock essentially it's perfectly normal and then all you got to do is kind of clean it up you know what i'm saying just clean it up that's all you got to do just clean it up just clean it up just clean it up that's all you got to do Boom, two damage. And then you just hope that Bedeck Bedazzle gets exiled under Arcane Bombardment. You hope that that doesn't get bounced or removed. That's very, very important. Unfortunately, in the Explorer format, there's no Tefri's protection, so you can't run white. Um, there's a few things that we don't have access to, which is super, super scary for this particular deck. Um, but we haven't ran into any of those issues yet. Thank you. The only necessary cards for this deck to function are going to be the four Arcane Bombardments, the three Casualties of War, the four Bedeck Bedazzles, three Star of Extinctions, four Cascading Cataracts, and now I'd probably say the four Proving Grounds because those Tri-Lands are invaluable. They're so, so, so good. So that's going to be a total of 15 rares. I mean, 17 if you include the Invoke Despairs, but who needs win conditions, right? Uh, and then seven Mythics, of course. But outside of that, you can just fill the deck in with whatever instants and sorceries you want, but I personally really want to experiment with Our Promise and Mastermind's Acquisition. Now, this deck is begging for some historic cards, especially some of the ramp ones like Explore or Into the North, but let me know in the comment section below if you want to see an Explore version and a historic version of every single deck. Maybe like a one video of each. I don't know, maybe there's ideas all over the place but we are very interested in all of your ideas so please let us know all right don't you dot 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 me you fuck 
Sparky's such a condescending bitch. What the fuck? At the end of the night, this deck went three and two. Now we didn't get a ton of time to play this because one of the games just kind of tied us up for a really long time, but it's a really fun deck to play. And I think it gives us a little bit of a better idea of what Arcane Bombardment can actually do. And this is still the very first day of the Explorer format. So anything can really change. There's no established meta. There, there just isn't anything. I've noticed that I play a lot of alchemy and a lot, or a lot of alchemy cards and a lot of rebalanced cards. So it was very difficult for me to actually look. I was looking for cards and they just didn't exist and it made me sad. So it was hard to find alternatives. It was really hard to find alternatives. <laughs> But I'm interested to see how the format develops. Let me know if you want me to play more Explore in the comments section below. Stay salty and enjoy the games. I feel like they're fucking with me on purpose. <laughs> it's things like that that shouldn't bother me. <laughs> but... <laughs> I don't know. I don't know why. I don't know. Don't look at me. It's so. It's funny. No, it has nothing to do with like the symmetry. It's more of a what? But how? You had it right everywhere else. What up, Mad Jawa? Snap keep, right? I just need a red source. No, we already did. You gave birth. What are we naming the baby? All right, red source up top. Easy, easy red source. Zombie wave. Easy red source. Mickey? All right. Told you. That's fine. <laughs> Esports. Hmm. I don't think I like that card. Yeah. I don't like. <laughs> Finally able to clear out the Jabay counter? No, I got Jabated earlier. I literally got Jabated earlier because the pack light is still there even though I have no more packs open. <laughs> I clicked on it like, what? <laughs> I was so upset. <laughs> I got Jabated so fucking hard. <laughs> Don't leave my bombardment alone. Please. But also don't kill me. I don't know what you're doing. I just don't like it. Migration path? Okay. I see you. I see you. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Sure. <laughs> I didn't want the soot. I don't want the soot at all. I didn't. Did they change the animation? I know. All right, come on, baby. Come on, baby. Now don't touch anything. 
Land, creature, artifact. Artifact, creature, land. Sure. Sure. <laughs> oh boy! You have no black. I don't know why I'm not getting rid of their blue sources. Because they're blue and green. Can kill my... I mean, everything they have. They can bounce my bombardment. They can They can do a lot of shit. I have no way to protect it. What the fuck is this thing? Oh, that's kind of funny. What happens if they make it a 4-1 and then I make it a... <laughs> <laughs> Rare, rarity rates being flagged as racist Yeah. Well, obviously it's getting automated. If you if you look at it in a way that weird people look at it. <laughs> like stupid ignorant people look at it. <laughs> All right. We're doing it. I need you to play a non-basic land for me, opponent. Nope. I see. Uh, creature land. That one. That one. Sure. You can get sooted every time. <laughs> yeah, I'll take another land. I'll draw another card. Never seen so many stars go extinct before. It's beautiful. <laughs> These cultivates are fucking useless. Fucking useless sack of shit. Get out. <laughs> All right. Now that we have that result. Ingrid would be so good. Well, we have four extinction events. It's just this is the first time we drew one. So, extinction event is actually fantastic, too. Uh, land creature. Uh, land. Uh, land. Cleansing wildfire. I choose you. Starve extinct. Wait, but your lands. But. You still had one left, and you were going to search for another one. I only played stuff in direct challenges, so. I don't know. I don't know enough yet. I don't know enough. That was only game two. So many people hate alchemy and rebalance stuff. Yeah. And I don't, I don't know. I think, I think what they should do is just rename Magic Arena to something else. And then put it under a different banner and say, 
hey, yeah, we leased out our IP to some other gaming company. And they just use all of the stuff and then they do all the changes and stuff that they want to do. It's all digital. See, why couldn't you have played this on the previous game? Like a normal person. Like if this, if Magic Arena wasn't made by WotC at all and it was just a different company and they made all the alterations and shit like that, they were doing new cards that other people weren't doing. Like, I think people would have a completely different opinion on it. I think. Although it wouldn't be nearly as popular as it is. Double red? All right. At least all of our mountains are different art. That is what's important. We need to identify. How are you supposed to mark your cards when the artwork's all the same? That's just preposterous. Why do you have so many man lands? What are you doing? What are you doing? To be fair, I'm not doing anything either. <laughs> Although, if you do something, ha ha! They did hear I wanted non-basics. They did hear that. Although, what are they doing with Faceless Haven? They don't have any... I guess they have one snow. I'm just going to hover. I'm going to touch their lands. Just let me touch it. Oh, yes, let me touch your snow. Oh, yes. Can I get a hi yes? There's no way they're running that one mana counter spell, right? <laughs> There's no way they're running Light of Hope, right? Right? Who runs enchantment removal in white, right? <laughs> I should be running at least some form of enchantment <laughs> recursion. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> Can white even do anything? No. Not 80 color or not 80 card white. I do no you don't. Stop lying. Look at my kitty face is intimidating. I have two different color eyes and shit. Ah <laughs> Disenchant shut up. It's gonna be light of hope, if anything. Right? It might be a disenchant since they seem a little weird. Wait, opponent, come back. I haven't done anything yet. You don't know what I'm doing. You don't know. I haven't even blown up your land yet. Stop it. Am I getting sandbagged? They're like, oh, they're going to be big mad when I blow that up. And I am going to be big mad when you blow that up. No. No. I'm be I'm I have my whole ha, my ha, blah, 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 blah. <laughs> Damn it! I'd like to see you try that again, you motherfucker! Ha ha! Ha ha! <laughs> You run disenchant lately because a lot of shrine decks. Do you have another one and another one? They do have another one, right? There's no way you have a second one in your 80 card deck, right? Professor Onyx would be another wink hunt. Yeah, it would be great to have Professor Onyx with copying all my Star of Extinctions. That'd be sweet. I would get so much use out of her. For so many copyings on all of my turns. It's a great idea. Why didn't I think of that? I should just starve extinction. <sighs> Where 
great cards. <laughs> I think if they activate a land, I'll probably just Baleful Mastery it. Although I'll hover over Blast Zone as a big debate. Well, I don't want to do that because they're, they're almost completely out of cards. They can do their Faceless Haven. But... You got it. Motherfucker. I will end you. All right, so now they don't have the mana to attack with the Faceless Haven because they need three snow sources. But they have a bajillion other man lands, right? I really, I was really hoping they didn't have a second one for that Arcane Bombardment. That's really sad. <laughs> the old tap land, do nothing play. I know, they were, uh, they were doing the things. Fuck you. I guess I should have waited for them to tap. Oh, you didn't tap that one? What happened? Okay, I've drawn nothing but lands for uh, one, two, three, four, five turns. Nice. I like it. I have a 29% chance to get a land. If I had one of those arcane bombardments, this would be a completely different game. And I'm going to die to this faceless haven. Which is the worst part. I have three casualties, two stars, and two field runes. So I have seven cards. Okay, so that doesn't do anything for me. Okay, give me. Now I have two stars and three casualties of war. And invoke. It kind of helps here. Star would be fantastic here. I agree. We must protect the people. Until next time, then. Hmm. I don't want to take any more damage than I need to. But this is not good for us. Not going to lie. Okay. Come on. Okay. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Just say go. Cave? That's only three damage, right? We don't care about the cave. We would rather them attack with the cave than the faceless, right? Right? All right. Draw three. Oh. Oh my God. Beautiful. Go. It's okay, opponent. I know you can do it. Instant speed, non basic land destruction. Another two demuge to the face. Let's go. We got this. Oh. 
Well, that sucked. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, five. This is great, because every time they tap their ship for mana to attack... Does that have Vigilance? Boom! Pokey! Oh my god, give it to me. Please! <laughs> man land Mandy! <laughs> exactly. Man land Mandy! Versus land destruction Lester. <laughs> you know I'm bad! Oh! I'm bad! Oh, I'm drunk. Stop it. Stop it. Sure, you got it. Mm hmm. I want to save the bedazzle for when they play another wanderer, because you can ping the wanderer for this as well. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Not the card I wanted. You know what? This is a grindy game. We need our arcane bombardments. Yeah, we just need our other two arcane bombardments. That's it. That's all I got. It's not like Mr. Mac. Mm -hmm. Drugs are bad. Mm -hmm. Lance on the battlefield and... <laughs> that your smash has been a citizen for 32 months. All right. All right. <laughs> it's so funny. It's still funny. <laughs> uh, I can't play lands. What is this? <laughs> play the ultimate feature. To hey, first of all, they're playing like every man land on the planet. And they. Yes! Aha! Wait. Hold on. Is it because there's no valid target? Is it because there's no target? Yeah? Okay. Do you have a fucking another one? Do you have a third one? In the top 24 cards. <laughs> Please no. Please no. <laughs> this person's plan is almost all man lands. Well, yeah, but they got, they got Tomic. They have Raiden, they have Wanderer. I have no way to win anymore. I actually have no way to win anymore. Those are both my Invoke Despairs.
I only have two more bedazzles. <laughs> I... <laughs> what was my Wencon? Infinite Invoke Despairs. It's the same it was when we were building it. It was the same it was the last time somebody brought it up. It was the same time the last time you asked. It was the same time... It was the same thing the last time you asked before that. Guy's Blessing needed? Yeah, Guy's Blessing would have been sweet against the sorcery spell that they cast on their turn. That would have been great. Why didn't I think of that? Hmm. How much does approach cost? No one knows. I know. I don't even know if I... Oh, yeah, I do. I have casualties. I know. I have I have four Bedeck Bedazzles that do two damage. Wait, do I still have... No. Two. Yeah, I only have two more. Two more. I can do four damage to them. <laughs> so that's why they're doing this. Because they, they're using the Facebook combo. It all makes sense. <sighs> that fucking sucked. Okay. Mm. Hmm. Hmm. Let's do. Let's tap it on tap creature control. On tap 15. T Untap 15 tapped creatures? How are you even going to do that? Use cultivate to examine what's left? I already, I already know what's left. I have. I have untapped. Come on! Oh, wait, that was the only card left. <laughs> it, was the, it was the only one left. Tokens, yes, but how are you going to get 15 tokens, is what I'm saying. See you later. So they're going to test it this weekend? You should... Play this land destruction deck against. <laughs> All right. I would like you to go fuck yourself. Uh huh. <laughs> what up here, say? Play Absam, play the Titan, you get 11 pests, you only need four creatures, also high. Yes. Oh, so what I was going to do with Halo Fountain is that I... But also, I was talking about how how is this person going to get it, you know? Um, because there's literally no way that they're going to get it. All right, you can go fuck yourself. All right, you can go fuck yourself again. And you know what? Why not? Soot. <laughs> I'm actually pissed that they exiled all of my wing cons. I am omega pissed. <laughs> Your lands go to the shadow. Oh no, so what I'm going to do with um with halo fountain is you play sylvan awakening <laughs> it 
the deck bedazzle yeah i only have i only have two more so i need to make sure oh that's true we need to make sure we keep it for their non-basics we need to make sure we don't blow up their non-basics that's what we got to do that makes sense because we have, we have two more we need to make sure that they have two more non-basics which they do right can they exile that with this cost two less for each card exiled this way so one and then one two three four five six seven eight they can one mana and they can exile my fucking arcane bombardment there's no fucking way they can actually do that fuck your life bing bong deck bedazzle can I just, well, I don't know. We tried it earlier and it wasn't letting me. Great card. Great card. No, earlier when we had it, um, earlier when we had it exiled, it would only let us cast Bedeck. We couldn't cast Bedazzle. Rip Grandma! Rip Grandma! Grandma's dead now! Rip Grandma! Um... Hmm. I'd like, I don't want to do it. But. Because I, I feel like it's going to fuck it up. All right. I'm just going to do that. No, I want to leave it because now I want to test. Yes, yeah, science. Now I want to test. Because we saw it earlier. I'm a goddamn man. True. All right. <gasps> Real man don't cry. Okay. True. Fuck. <laughs> they can still kill this, right? Which I can't let them do because I'm dead if they do that. But they can do it if they top deck one land. Right? Ugh. How the hell do you get one of those? Um, yeah, I don't know. Someone has to clip a clip. Or I have to find a funny clip. Uh, yeah, you just have to have clips. If you get clips, I find the clips. If I find the funny clips, then I might clip and then you clip next one. I'm bad. Woo! I'm bad. Woo! I'm drunk. Stop, Stop it. it. Stop it. All right, casualties. Like it? Why is opponent so bad at magic? Because they're playing Hearthstone. When yeah. you say that I have butthole lips. True. Because, like. Why are they still playing? Because they can deck me out. I'm be I'm I have my whole ha, my ha, <laughs> blah 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 blah.
Baleful Mastery, homie discount, deck them. I they well they can't play anything. What is the fast fingers? Say to the face! <laughs> what? Slap! <laughs> Whoa, no touchy. No touchy. I need I need another card. Okay, so now we'll test it, all right? I'll show you what it's like. I'll show you what it's like. Just went off. <laughs> I fucking love that skit. From Mad TV. Oh my god, Coach Hines is like the best. Okay, see, watch. I'll show you. I, I'm be, I'm, I have my whole, ha, my ha, blah, 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 blah. Okay, it works this time, apparently. So if there's a creature, if there's a creature, it doesn't, it doesn't let you choose. But if there, okay, I need to test this out. After, this game. after this game, we're testing it. Okay, I don't care. After this game, we're testing it. Can someone make a deck? You'll test it, thank you. I need you to have basic lands only and then a creature. <laughs> okay, I don't think I've ever done 10 damage with Bedazzle before. <laughs> we did win two. We did, in fact, win two. Ah! It's me. I'm all fluffy and shit. Look at that. <laughs> We're definitely, definitely going to have to be doing some testing. Definitely have to do some testing. What's up, Quentin? Thanks so much for the Twitch Prime. I appreciate you. Zombie wave. What time do I sleep? Day of the week? Um... Depending on the day and depending on what I have already done. Yeah, it just kind of depends. I go to sleep anytime between midnight and 3 a.m. And then I wake up at like 7.38 and that's when I work. Yeah. Boo! It's a spicy meatball. I would like to not allow you to have any of those. I have a blast zone that I can start using next turn. But yeah, I, I definitely need to get way more sleep than I actually do. It's really bad. All right, casualties war off the top, easy. Easy clap. Casualties, boom, calling it. Oh my God, I am a fucking God. God, I tell you. All right, let me pull down my pants and bend over real quick. Rip grandma. No, you haven't eaten my Rip ass grandma. yet? Grandma, grandma's dead now. Rip grandma. No, what about now? No? Okay, okay. Let's see what's going on here. All right, all right. Esports, baby.
There's no red doesn't have removal for enchantments, do they? Do they? No. Wait, do they? Stay down. Shoulder. Chin. Shoulder, shoulder, shoulder. Double dream hands. Okay. I want to be like really fucked up. But I won't. Depends. Depends on what I exile here. You can draw a card. Sure. I'll give you the homie discount. They already drew the card, so. Jesus! Would you fucking knock it off? Why do you have three shocks? Damn it, so close. It's not gonna give them the homie discount, is it? Okay, I didn't think so. I didn't think it was going to. But you never know. I'm fucked, right? <laughs> <laughs> this is the second time that we have had this conundrum. Maybe I should have kept that on one. I don't even know. Uh, land? <laughs> Take action. Yes. Good card. I think I... I think I needed to start getting black sources, actually. Because <laughs> I needed that black so I could even cast my Invoke Despair. Yes! How do you have no three... <laughs> How do you have no three damage burn spell? Granted, I was going to blow up a land every single turn. But they have, they have like, fasty boys... That's why I had to keep this, unfortunately. But I was going to be able to play that one next turn. Having two of them is kind of d -d disgusting. Why not? They, I don't know. I was, I was really close to dying. Thank you all so much for watching. If you made it to this point, it means you either really enjoyed the video or you fell asleep and I'm waking you up now. <laughs> either way, thank you for all the support. I really do appreciate it. If you want to see more videos like this, hit that subscribe button. Hit the bell notification. Come out with videos seven days a week.